Why, hello, boys and girls. How is everybody doing this wonderful day? I was just going to give you a quick rundown on my gloves and my jacket. In case you can't see the blue of my jacket. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, they're new. And, well, the gloves apparently are called... Five? Five. Yes, five. And the jacket is a scorpion jacket, and it is a pretty light blue and gray. So almost a silver. I will show you a picture of them when I have a chance. Right now, of course, I'm riding, so I can't show you anything. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, these are my new fiber gloves. They're more of a material than a leather. I mean, they have the little padding on them and stuff like that, but apparently they're supposed to be really good for uh, touch screen stuff. I haven't tried it out yet, but whoa. That was not cool, dude. I don't know who did that, but I did not like that. <laughs> but I have control, so I'm fine. The hazards of the road, huh? Good thing I was planning on turning and not going straight because I might have uh, taken it a little bit harder. Wow. Considering the other cars were hiding it from me. So yeah, apparently they have like the touch screen capability. I haven't really tested it out yet. And of course the jacket is a textile so it's really good for these warm days because it's got good airflow and stuff. So. Uh, so far, I really like it. It's got little snappy snaps to keep it closed at my cuffs, which I actually prefer over the uh, Velcro, of course. I find that it keeps a little bit more steady with my hand. Like, see? It snaps. <laughs> but, yeah, I, so far, I actually love it. I got them both at uh, Imperial Motorsports. The, anytime I've ever went in there, they always try to help me find what I want. If they don't have it, they tell me where I can go to find it. And if that is not the case either, they order me stuff. So like this jacket, I tried it on, I think I tried it on the black version. And then I got to choose which color I wanted and they ordered it in for me. And it takes like a week usually. Uh, Andy's pretty good at that stuff. But I'm really enjoying it. Like the gloves are really comfortable. They're not making my hands cold. Like the perforated ones I found, especially in the early morning hours, uh, I get a bigger chance of uh, getting the cold hands because of the perforation. Where with these ones, I still get the cold hand, but not the same way. I haven't had a chance to test it in all weather conditions, obviously. I'm not gonna go put my hand in cold water and go, it works, but uh, <laughs> So far, so good. I like them. They're comfortable. They fit, especially the fingers that are the most important, which are the index and middle and the thumb. They fit there. They do what they need to do. They don't make my hand sore when I'm holding it. And like I said, the jacket, I love it because it's a low collar, so it doesn't feel like uh, it's riding up against my helmet, which is very important because I hate when it feels like it's riding up the back of my helmet. Riding up the helmet, like when you turn your head and then you get that noise from the hel uh, helmet and the jacket colliding, I'm like, no, stop, no, I don't like that. And I mean, the zipper is good quality. It's a little, li little bit, um, what's the word I'm looking for here? It's a little bit more high-waisted than I prefer, but it works and it's got a nice little loop in the back that I can attach it to the pants if I want to, which I haven't tried yet. I should one day, because apparently that's supposed to be like really good for the jacket not riding up your back. But I haven't had the op the need to do that yet, because usually I have the backpack on too, which kind of helps with that. So. so that is my quick little review on my new gear, and I hope that you enjoyed it. Until next time, don't forget to love, ride, and explore. Be safe out there and subscribe if you feel like it. And don't forget the little bell so you know when we upload. Till next time, take care. Ta-ta.